means if we have that impact, that means we should have a purpose d different than the other. So it's done the connection between I will tell you being why. able to have a decision-making process and that meaning that we have a purpose. Okay. Now, before we get to the purpose, let's go back to the, to the first one. Huh? But that was my question. Yeah, okay. You said you've, you've made that assumption, That's and good. I don't see the connect. All right, good. Now, if we say, if Sorry, we say, no, 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 you're not giving a hard time. That's why we get these questions always. Now, if we say, if we don't have a, now, if we say, let's assume the other way around. Let's assume that we don't have a purpose. Yeah? Suppose this, we have no purpose. What are we doing here? If it's to eat, drink, and reproduct animals, they do a better job than this. And if it's about the nature to produce some kind of a creature that has to do this, there are better creatures doing a better job than our, our, our existence. Yeah. And actually, they will not cause the pollution and destruction of the, of the earth. Mm -hmm. So, what's the purpose of our life? Everything in the world is the best of. So, if we go with Darwin's theory, we're surviving, but we may not be better than a spider at producing, or we may not be better than bees at maintaining the environment. But that doesn't mean we aren't as valid, and it doesn't mean the pollution doesn't have a purpose. In yeah. my mind. So, do you think the pollution has a purpose? No, I'm saying that we don't necessarily have to have a purpose, even if, even if we are able to make decisions, and even if they're yes. better at producing than us. Yeah, the, the point is, here, either we, when we are talking about because i answered the question about if we, we assume the other way around we said if it's about for example we know if you go to the yeah the, not necessarily everything as perfect as we think i agree with you but in the same time but we know things that they are kind of there is a harmony between all the other things but when the human being interrupt into, into this harmony this harmony will be interrupted it will be it, it will change that means we have an impact decision on certain things and and we have as well we decide things that not just having impact on our species as own and actually we do, we have a mass destruction mechanism that we could destroy everything like someone if two people on earth they just decide today you know what let's start the war we finish we finish yeah. all of us yeah two people just only two people yeah for example the president of russia and the president of america did that then we're done we finished yeah. a couple of buttons right? we did so the point is that, see you see here this is these things is not with the, with the other ones so what made us to be like this and why we are what are we doing here now before answering this question going back to the beginning what do we say this universe came into existence and this universe confirmed that it has a beginning it's confirmed it's a fact so if it has a beginning how it came into existence it's either created itself by itself which is a hypothesis or it was there always or it was created one of these options which one do you think well, we haven't thought of, but I think the first one. The first one. I'm so sorry, but I have to go. Created itself by itself. Do you know the first one? I'm so sorry. Do you know what I means of this? Before you go this. Yeah. Do you know what means created itself by itself? Which means it has to pre-exist before existence. Okay. Like giving birth to yourself before you're born. You have to pre-exist before existence. It's total illogical thing to say. But maybe we don't have a full grasp of time, and time isn't linear, and it's all... <laughs> no, uh, time... Uh, anyway, anyway, no problem. SubhanAllah. May Allah Azza wa guide, guide them. Because you see, some people, they think we believe in science. Actually, they believe in science as a blind belief. But actually, the science doesn't say what they say. The science say there is a beginning for the universe. And the science as well say there are some fact, facts in relation to it. But actually, we as Muslims, we take the scientific facts as evidence, no problem, to use them to say for well, those are scientific facts. But to use them about for own our, you know, uh, of understanding Islam, that's, that's not necessarily always the case. But that's why we ask Allah to guide those people and to bring them to the right path. And at the same time, sometimes people, when they are, when they have no answer, what they will do, they will say it's, it's the science. It's actually the science they didn't say this. We ask Allah to guide us all. Jazakumullah khairan.